Good morning, thanks for joining me. Welcome to the bathroom. Thank you. She who must be obeyed, otherwise known as Mrs. H. Thank you. <laughs> right. Uh, another new model, I should say, of razor today. Uh, in the description, probably. Um, and it is this thing. It's a beast of a... And that is the Pearl Flexi Open Comb. Now, I've used the Pearl closed comb many times which is that one you can see closed comb the difference is the handle the grip the knurling that's beautiful good grip there's a lined um, base on the bottom that's got a lined base on the bottom but this is a thicker one um, there's a slight difference in the yeah, there's a slight difference in the um, adjuster there. The gaps are bigger on here, as you can see there, hopefully. Uh, numbering's the same up here. Um, this one is about a millimetre or two taller than this. Just to show you the, the, the difference. So that's that. So this came from Pearl themselves in India. Um, they've just contacted me actually, funny enough, last week. And then this is the one I had sent from the UK stockist Phil. Thanks again Phil, I'll put all his details like I did last time in the video description. Uh, really good grip on this. It feels, you know, you wouldn't want it, it's clever. Right, so you t twist the base, obviously. Take the top off. There's a long thread. Nicely oiled as well. There you go, that's that. And I'm going to use, I enjoyed the Nasset blade, so I'm going to use, it'll be a second use for it, won't it? In that last shape, I really enjoyed that, so I'm going to... So you've got the lined, the two lines there, keeping the blade in its place. And place that down. Funny, you see that oil really like that because um, I have washed this razor. That's good, that's good to see. Okay, so it is an adjustable, open comb adjustable. So we're going to take it, and I'll show you now, to its highest aggression which is number six and we'll work our way down so will this have a bite similar um, to the um, hammer right so as usual it comes in a box it says open comb on there and uh, nicely packaged the pearl products there's a razor stand there base good way to it there's always like a it's like a resin type thing rubbery resin so it doesn't scratch or damage the base uh, the porcelain and the razor fits in there obviously and there's a black banding on it and all the new definition of shaving there's a thank you card as always um cleaning cloth so it's always nice packaging nice detail now the soap very exciting this i've used many times but it's a soap I found randomly on, I don't know if they still sell it on eBay or someone was selling it, uh, a, by appointment to, to King George, um, this, if you can see there, Lever, Lever's Easy Shave Stick, Lever Brothers, on the Wirral, not far from here, about 30 odd miles, I think 30, 35 miles, um, Lever Brothers, it's where the soap, it's a huge worldwide known soap maker, of uh, washing detergents, all sorts of soaps, hand soaps, uh, obviously a shave stick here. And the brute aftershave we have in the supermarkets today, they make that. I didn't know that, but they make the they make the brute. So that's what it is. 
Now you think, oh, palm olive. Now there is a resemblance to palm olive in a way, but there is a big difference. And I love this. Absolutely love it. This does take me back to a... Must have used this. I don't know if it was called easy then. I don't remember any of my family using this. Um, obviously because it was before my time but uh, they could have used it my grandfather could have used it but um, this reminds me of a oh just beautiful scent so I'm going to face lather and then uh, we'll get going so the razor's ready anyway how are you doing oh I got another razor coming to use um, I've got a soap. I've used the company many, many, many times, but uh, I've never used this sort of scent before. And you don't see much of it being used on YouTube, shaving. This is one way my grandfather used to do it, and my dad. Now we need a good coverage if we're going to be, uh, oh brush, DS Cosmetic, um, just a synthetic with a red resin handle, long brush, nice nice to hold these, Good. Um, this was the same, if it's there, design as my first brush from them, with the white, uh, no it must be in the other room, with a white, same handle but a white knot, synthetic, there we go, wet but not dripping. Don't splash the people at home. Yeah, I have these soaps off a seller on eBay. Um, but I'm not sure now if uh, it looked, I think if I remember rightly, it looked like um, someone who just sold sort of, what can I say, like antique type stuff. Um, but as I say, it could be, you could, you could, there could be a seller of it somewhere. But, uh, I just came across it, I was very grateful. But it was nicer than I, I didn't know what it was going to be like. I thought, oh, you know, it could be anything. Someone could have just put a palm olive in a box. <laughs> but it's lovely, really nice. So, Pearl Flexi Open Comb. First use for me. Uh, highest setting with a Gillette Nasset. Second use. We'll just heat the head up. Using the easy Lever Brothers shave stick yeah oh that's nice I don't know why I thought that was going to be a bit more aggressive than it feels but I don't judge things too soon on a first pass because there's too many too many oh, straight through that is very very efficient too many um, whiskers protecting the skin at the moment that is nice making this so easy that's a nice blade as well you know yeah What's the shave of the day if you're having one? Did you have a nice Easter and weekend since I've seen you?
Look at them whiskers. Whew. That was nice. So initial, when you look at that, you think, ooh, it's gonna have a bite to it, this. Not always the case. Very slick soap, wow. Go skiing off my cheeks. Um, a bit more, a bit of water. So easy. Look at that. All the shaving tools are doing just exactly as they should. Um, so we'll use it as an adjuster. We'll just knock it down. I was going to go down to four then, but we'll take it down. I'll tell you what, let's take it to a. Uh, just bear with me. I can't grip the adjuster. Um, soap is too slick. Uh, let's be let's be odd. Well, I am odd, but let's take it to a four and a half on the doctor. By the way, no overhang. Good way to this, pearl, made in India. Um, if you can see any of that writing on the base there. I know. It's a job to made in India. Uh, pearl, and there's a number there. Um, marked on the bottom. Really nice heavyweight short handle. Feels lovely in the hand. A very good grip. You may have had one or tried one. Across the growth, here we go. Yeah, so you can feel that slightly less. Now, in regards to aggression, it's a bit like heat in chilies, really. What I would class as hot, you may not, or you may think it blows your head off. Now, what I class as a, this, to me, on setting six, you can feel the blade, but it felt so smooth, and it just sort of glided through the whiskers nicely. You know, it didn't feel aggressive. Uh, it just felt nice. Listen to that. Um, so I'd say, for, for, for me, with this shave now, setting six would be high-end mid-aggression. Um, the hammer was low-end aggressive, wasn't it? So that is a bit more aggressive. As I say, for me, we're all different. Very important to remember that. Cause... But this setting is nice, it's like a... It's a standard aggression, but it feels so precise, the razor. Um, the weight is no problem, the grip is superb, soap is slick, so what? Really, what's not to like? Yeah. Here we go, I haven't been back to the, the soap. fashioned I wouldn't say it's a classic scent it's how can I put this now if you like palm olive scent you'd love this but it's not palm olive it's, it's like a it's cousin <laughs> but it has a scent which I've never smelt anywhere else but it, I've smelt years ago if that makes sense reminds me of something yet again um, we'll take it down now to uh, 
this bear with me. This soap so slick I can't grip this. Right. I'm gonna take it to uh let's try three then. Go on. Might as well use it as a halfway now, halfway on the aggression scale, one to six, isn't it? So we're on where are you? We're on number three on the dot there. And this is against the growth. As you can see it's getting thinner now. Less so, but uh, very, very, very slick. This is lovely. So aggression now, still in medium, but I'd say it's a low end medium now. Uh, so the adjustments Are pretty good for me as in three is midway still but it's getting to the milder which would be two and one so it's for some raises uh, you can use them like a Merca Future it's aggressive on six and it's aggressive on one for most people Lovely. That is nice. Forget how slick that soap is. Three, two, one. Slick time, baby. <laughs> there should be enough in the brush, actually. Just about. No wastage here. Yeah. Here we go, we'll keep it on setting, uh, where are we on three? We'll keep it on that. I don't think I'd go any lower. I was in the comments on the, uh, the hammer, Pearl Hammer, I've seen Paul if you're watching Paul, nice to um, hear off you in the comments on that and hope your shaving channel is doing well. Paul Shaving Fox. It's a shaving fox, isn't it? Nice man. He said he's got the hammer. Keeps it in the shed. That is lovely. Oh, just a turn. Should I 
she was a bit there. That'll do me. Very nice cold water rinse then. And uh, Well, that's a change, it's not as cold today. <laughs> Somebody must have been with a blowtorch on the pipes. Oh, there's a scent um, of a soap. That is lovely. That is a nice razor, that. And the Nasset is a good, so I've used that Nasset in the Gillette Ball and Tech, beautiful shave. And that's a fairly mild uh, razor, isn't it? It's not um, aggressive in any way. But this is a step up, so the blade, and it's open comb, the blade works beautifully in, in two. So it shows, it, it, if a blade works for you, sometimes it'll usually work in several types of razors. Um, but that's the fun of trying different blades, you know, uh, and that's something you have to find out yourself. Um, blades, I don't think anybody can advise anybody on blades, really. Um, truthfully, I mean, you know, to, to really find out what blade works for you. This is not just a bottle of water, it's which <laughs> tea tree and witch hazel, which I made. Um, I forgot I'd done this because I got a bottle which is down here now, and it, this was next to it. So I thought, I don't remember doing this, but I must have done the two together. So, uh, just using this one to make sure it's okay. Yeah, that's lovely. Tea tree and witch hazel. I just decant, I bought these on um, a pack of 12 of them, I think. 200ml twist cap bottles. Oh, I'm going to use this uh, Floyd the Genuine. I haven't used that for a while. This is a nice... Uh, I like this aftershave. Oh, that's a classic, I tell you that. Oh, <laughs> And I'm going to use this Nivea cream. I quite like this. It's like a thick version of Nivea. It's like a, it's like Arco and Nivea did a co co collaboration. <laughs> you can hear it squeaking. Put a bit more on it. You've got to work this in, see. I'll just show you. See? Oh, that's nice. Yeah, you can put a little bit of mount, a little bit of mount, a little amount on your hands, and it'll quickly do. But if you just want that bit more blobs, that is quite thick to work in. Good workout for your skin. Right, so we've used. And again, thank you, Phil. I'll put all his details in the in the description. He's a UK stockist of pearl razors, and um, you can either buy through his eBay or direct by his email or phone. I'll put all the things like I did last time. Um, so the pearl flexi open comb, really nice razor, short handle, heavyweight, excellent grip, nice design, adjustable. Um, Aggressive on you can feel the blade on number six as I say. I'd only say it's a high-end mid-aggression for me because it felt so it didn't feel what I thought it was gonna be. It was so um smooth, just cut, cut and glided easily through. And that's the blade as well, obviously. Um and then we used it as an adjustable to me uh, right down to number three. Did we go to three yeah? for a for against the growth and uh, pickups? But number three, when we went down to that, that felt sort of low end mid aggression then. So number two and one would have been mild. So it's well 
the numbers work for me on this razor it's exactly as it says on the tin so really happy with that so uh, lovely razor Gillette Nasset fantastic blade really like that I'm finding blades now which I've used in the past many times but like the Gillette Nasset the feather high stainless are becoming my go-to blades you know it's, it's uh, how things change then we used uh, DS Cosmetic the red brush synthetic not of course the easy uh, lever brothers uh, soap which I had on eBay there's the box there lovely very slick easy to lather as you can see and the scent which I adore and I've not smelled that scent anywhere else Welsh water to rinse now we've used homemade tea tree and witch hazel Floyd the genuine aftershave and um, Nivea cream or creme as it says there from home bargains so that's it I'll leave you to it have a fantastic uh, rest of the week look after yourselves and thanks again um, for watching and for your time and for your comments I really appreciate it and uh, I'll see you in yeah, Sunday for the weekend shave let them go Paul alright thanks a lot bye bye take care